each spacewalk, we use the same suit, the same gloves, and we use them over and over again. And in previous missions, there were several instances where the gloves of the crew members were cut on a sharp object of some kind outside the space station. And we call them spacewalks, but really what we're doing is we're translating or moving around the space station using our hands and arms. You're not really walking, you're pulling yourself hand over hand. So your gloves get a lot of wear and tear. And what we've been finding out is there's sharp edges on the space station, probably caused by micrometeorites or small objects hitting the space station at a very high speed and causing a rough or sharp edge. So what happens is when you grab it with your glove, you can get abrasions or cuts in your glove. So what happened to me was I was out on my third spacewalk. My gloves were getting a little bit worn from just being used for the third time. And as part of the protocol or the process that we have to check the astronaut's gloves on occasion, our, our IVA, who's the person who's running the spacewalk from inside, gives us a call every once in a while and says, hey, guys, check your gloves. So I check out my right glove. My right glove looked pretty good. had a small little hole in, in the thumb, but nothing serious. I reported that. And then I saw my, looked at my left glove, and I che checked it. As I was checking it, I saw a much bigger hole, and I could actually see uh, like a metal underneath it, so I could tell that the hole was pretty deep. And at that point, I had a decision to make. What I decided to do was to report it to Mission Control because if I didn't, they wouldn't know what was going on and I would be jeopardizing not only the mission but possibly my life. So I had to tell Mission Control, Ground Control, what was going on so they could help decide what the right course of action was. But what they wanted to do was to just make sure I stayed safe. They had me go inside the airlock at that point and plug into the, the uh, space station's oxygen so that I, in case the glove did pop the hole pop through I would be safe and have plenty of oxygen uh, but luckily that was about two-thirds or more than halfway through the spacewalk we had finished the majority of our tasks so there wasn't much left to do mm -hmm. 